Hello everyone, this is Amit Dan of AmitDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of credit card video and I'll talk about the American Express Airmas Platinum credit card. There are changes coming to this credit card starting November 4, 2019 and I'll go over uh, some of the changes and I'll uh, provide you my non-affiliated, unbiased and honest opinion whether you know it makes sense to have this card or you have better options uh, to have other Airmas credit cards. So let's start with uh, comparing what it is offering right now and what this is going to be after the change starting November 4th. So the first thing notice that the annual fee is going to be increased to $120 from $65 and there is a significant change in the earned rate uh, which is going to be increased a lot. So for example right now you earn $10 per I'm sorry, you earn one mile for every $10 at grocery, gas, and drug stores in Canada. And for everything else, you earn one mile for $15, which is going to be changed to one mile for each $5 in restaurants, coffee shops, gas, and transit. And there's a cap up to $30,000 annually. And for everything else, you'll be earning one mile for each $10 and uh, they're throwing in some uh, annual travel redemption benefit so for example uh, when you redeem your air miles per year for the first redemption once per calendar year if you are redeeming via eligible dream miles with air miles reward program to book your first uh, single flight or package vacation through the air miles website then it's going to happen is that you're going to be getting bonus miles equivalent to 25 percent of the total miles you used uh, which cannot exceed uh, 750 air miles so that's uh, a change and then uh, the interest rate is slightly changing it's not a that a big change so i value per air miles 10 cents never redeem air miles below 10 cents but if you redeem for travel or flights then you can get actually more than 10 cents uh, you can get up to let's say 15 cents per air mile or even 20 cents depending on how you redeem so whenever you're redeeming for uh, travel or flight purposes then you get the most value of uh, the air miles but uh, for this uh, calculation i'm going to just assume that you're getting the 10 cents per air mile value and if you do that then the highest on rate uh, for the new uh, after the changes is going to be per five dollars you'll get one air mile so that gives you about two percent return per dollar which is not bad but it's not that great either and the rate even goes lower if you are you know spending or using the card for everything else categories which is ten dollars per one mile and then there's the hundred twenty dollars annual fee which is currently sixty five dollars so unless you are totally uh, depending on air mass or this is your only rewards program uh, i don't see any point paying 120 dollars and uh, to use this card because uh, this card is just giving you some increased uh, air miles earn ratio however when you uh, compare this card uh, in terms of uh, benefits it has almost no benefits so for example let's go over some of the benefits uh, this card offers in terms of travel and shopping coverages it has car rental theft and damage insurance hundred thousand dollars travel accident insurance purchase protection and buyers assurance protection so that's all you're gonna get there's no travel insurances or any uh, anniversary bonus or any lounge access or anything so this is a very poor card in terms of benefits but if you go to other cars paying the same $120 annual fee, you'll be getting a lot more. For example, another highest earned rate credit card for air miles we have on the market is that the BMO Air Miles World Elite credit card. The BMO Air Miles World Elite MasterCard has the same annual fee, $120. And if you look at the benefit, this card actually has uh, one air mile per ten dollar definitely is lower than what the american express platinum is going to give you after november 4 but in terms of benefit you get a lot more uh, for having this card for example it gives you complimentary lounge key 
access with the two annual complimentary free passes. So what, what it means that, you know, you have uh, the lounge key membership plus two free annual uh, passes. So if you only use this benefit, your return is $215 Canadian because uh, if you purchase the same uh, lounge membership via priority pass, then it's $99 US and each vis visit is $32 US. So if you add, add that up, then two free passes plus lounge key, which is only for MasterCard members. It's almost same like the Priority Pass memberships, a little bit different, but uh, you know, uh, MasterCards, lots of MasterCards, they're switching to lounge key from Priority Pass. They're owned by the same parent company. So let's say if you want to get this benefit by paying dollars, then you're gonna be paying $215. So your annual fee, $120, you get much more than $120 right here, just using only one benefit. But it has full medical insurance coverage benefits. So you get all travel and medical protection for 15 days and then up to $2 million, which the American Express Air Mass does not provide. And then you have other benefits. For example, you get 15% discount on flights in North America when you book with uh, this credit card. And uh, Basically, these are the main benefits, and also another benefit uh, this card has, Demo Air Miles World Elite Mastercard, is it's the concierge service. Concierge service is like personal assistant, and they can help you with uh, travel arrangements or anything you can possibly imagine. So you get so much more with uh, the BMO World Elite Mastercard, just paying $120, with a slightly lower earn rate. But if you go to American Express Platinum. Air mass card, then you're just getting more air mass, uh, one mile per five dollars after November 4. But in terms of benefits and insurance, you have almost nothing. The four insurance benefits you're looking at, these are very basic benefits. Um, uh, even non no annual free credit cards would give you these benefits. So this card, no lounge access, no full travel and medical insurance benefits, no anniversary bonus, no nothing. So unless uh, you know, uh, air mass, you'd like to uh, earn more air miles, uh, which is going to be one air mile per five dollars and you don't want any benefits or any lounge access or anything concierge services then definitely the american express air miles platinum credit card is for you but if you're looking for one credit card which earns you one mile per ten dollars spent and then all the additional benefits including full travel medical insurance uh, two free lounge passes plus the membership and concierge service and much more then definitely uh, you should go for the BMO Airmas World Elite MasterCard. So that's all I wanted to talk about. Uh, thank you for watching this video. Forget about subscribing this channel. Forget about liking this video. I'll see you shortly.